Hi, I'm Maggie Germano and I'm a feminist and financial coach. I help women improve their relationship with money so they can take control of their finances. Three or four years ago, I was working in a job that I had been at for almost six years. I wasn't very happy. I didn't feel very passionate or engaged or interested in the work that I was doing, but I didn't really know what I wanted to do instead. In order to try to figure that out, I just threw myself into everything that I could find. I knew that I wanted to work with women. I knew that I wanted to work on issues that were affecting women and important to women, but I didn't really know what I wanted that to be. Through that, I realized that I was meeting a lot of women who were struggling with money. They you know, had a lot of student loan debt. They were really struggling with credit card debt. They felt like they had never been taught the proper way to manage their money or even how to make a budget that worked for them. And so as those kinds of issues were coming up more and more, I realized that that was something that I could help people with. Personal finance has always been something that was interesting to me, something I felt it was kind of like a side hobby of mine. I really liked learning and reading about personal finance. So I started offering these women the support that I felt I could give, whether it was sitting down and reviewing their budget, sitting down and helping them come up with a plan to pay off their credit card, or even just being a sounding board to, as someone to talk to about money when they've never felt like they could talk to anyone about money. So the more that I was doing that, the more I realized that this was actually an opportunity to combine personal finance that was an interest of mine with my desire to help women. And so I started my business as a financial coach uh, because rather than just giving them the numbers, I wanted to help women work on the habits, the mindset, the emotions and the behaviors that were present behind their money because in order to make long-term change that's really going to last them, they have to actually be aware of those things and be able to change those things.